This is unprecedented territory. It's obviously a devastating disease and we clearly need new tools to treat it. I think we've taken a little bit more of a cautious tact just given the controversy surrounding the drug, but also the uncertainty around reimbursement and access. Yeah, and apparently a lot of the, the discussion or the debate has been around the cost. Uh, $56,000 on this drug. And there's this big debate about not only how effective the drug may be for Alzheimer's, but and not about whether it's worth the money, Laura, but whether it's worth, I guess, paying that kind of money for the level of results that the trials have showed. Where does the, and I'm trying to be sensitive to everybody involved, it's a serious disease, a lot of people suffering from it, and, and at any cost, they want it to go away. Where does that debate fall to you? Where should it fall? It, you know, it, it's a really challenging question to answer, Brian. I think, you know, and that therein lies the huge challenge here. We have certain clinical outcomes that were evaluated in the trials, but translating that into a real world benefit is very complicated. Um, you've had agencies like ICER come out and evaluate the drug and determine it's really not cost effective um, and that the pricing would need to be considerably lower for it to be effective. And I think that that is gonna be the persistent problem as we go forward. Translating it, it into a real world benefit is gonna be a problem. Um, I think the Alzheimer's Association, Kaiser have all estimated the impact of Alzheimer's disease on society in the hundreds of billions of dollars. But, you know, making that decision is going to be a challenging one for patients and for their families. Um, Medicare has instituted a, a national coverage determination, and we should get a little bit more clarity on how they're going to handle reimbursing the drug by early 22. So where do we fall in the stock? You got a neutral rating. Any reason to own Biogen here, or do we just need to let this Alzheimer's debate shake out, Laura? Yeah, so our estimates for Aduhelm have been below consensus, and I think we're going to continue to see more of these headlines pop up, and the controversy is probably not going to abate in the near term. So we're staying cautious on that. Pairing that with the backdrop of increasing generic competition for flagship product Techfidera, and an also competitive environment in the SMA space, it's just a really challenging time. So for us, we're sticking with the sidelines here on Biogen. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.